Hello everyone, back with me again today in my gaming channel for the part 31 of the Witcher and his edition. Today I will still mainly focusing on exploring the city and we will start uh, completing the side quest in the next part. So keep watching everyone and have fun and don't forget to press like and subscribe. Welcome to my humble establishment. <laughs> Greetings. Can I help you? <laughs> Welcome to my humble establishment. <laughs> Greetings. Can I help you? Tell me about the meetings that occur upstairs. The noble Luvarden of the Merchant's Guild rented the first floor of my inn. I'm to supply food and drink and keep my mouth shut. I'm invited. Tell me more. If so, you know all you need to know. If you feel you don't, honor my discretion. Maybe some gold will untie your tongue. I like gold, but you can't possibly pay me as much as Luvarden. Besides, I'd rather not annoy his backers. Who's backing Luvarden? Quiet! I've said too much already. Oh, forgive me. This is well. Have a seat. I'll be with you soon. Take care. Geralt, I'm giving a concert tonight. You don't say. Thanks in no small part to you. Wanna play dice, kill some time? Not now, Dandelion. Bonds aren't allowed in the trade quarter. Yes. Godspeed. I'll feel safe among the shadows of the city wall. Mother hates me speaking of strangers. Wherever you turn, you find new followers now, of the eternal fire. How can I help? Good day. I love the smell of fish. Take care. <laughs> I heard a witcher lifted the curse of the Striga from Princess Ada. Why did they declare martial law in this district? It seems I withdrew my savings from Vivaldi's bank in time. Did you wipe your feet? What a 
Shadows of the city walls. I'm so clever. My brother gifted all he owned to the order to become a knight. I'm so No reason to be. The price of sulfur is dropping because of the trade war with the Damien. Don't interrupt! Vivaldi is insolvent! Wherever you turn, you find new followers of the eternal fire. What? My man continually complains. Armed as you are, I admire monastic knights. So handsome and they're so clever. I feel safe among the shadows of the city. Until tomorrow. The story law, taxes, and the state of emergency are killing cars. Greetings, stranger. Oh, be not afraid of Ada. She growls, but she doesn't bite. Usually. <laughs> The dog's name is Ada. She is a bitch. Plus, she's pampered and spoiled. The name of the king's daughter suits her perfectly. Do you know Princess Ada? Uh, my wife is a laundress at the palace, so I'm aware of the gossip in court. I'd be happy to listen if I could look at your goods. Mm, certainly. I have the finest quality meat. I slaughter the animals myself. We'll see. Hmm? Don't you fear bad-mouthing authorities during martial law? At worst, they'll throw me in the dungeon. I believe we must speak true, even of the ruling class. This is our right. Bold words. Indeed. I have no intention to fear a dictatorship based on the exploitation of common men. I will not cower under the grim repression of oligarchs and aristocrats who have enthroned a wrongdoer, a man whose hands are stained with blood. You exaggerate. Foltest's rule can't be that unpleasant. Ah, plague upon Foltest! I spit on monarchy, which long has been corrupt. Strange views. The people should rule! Common people like you and me! I'm not common, and I'm uninterested in ruling. You poor man! You've been indoctrinated by officials and by agitators who, for a few pieces of silver, whisper royalist propaganda in the ears of the masses. Open your eyes! Enough of that already. Hmm? Do you recognize me? Anything about me? Sure! The laundresses gossip about you! And? They say you chase anything in a skirt, but you're a real dog for sorceresses. Supposedly, you loved one once. <laughs> they say you're as likely to whip out your sword as you are to whip out your, um, um yeah, <clears throat> a master at both arts. <laughs> women fear your fickleness, but you fascinate them. Hey, women. Hmm. Thanks. Hmm? What does your wife say about the other courtiers? <laughs> it would take weeks to repeat all she said. Foltest, Velerad, Duet, Jacques de Oldersburg, Medigold, who were you interested in? Any gossip about Triss Marigold? Certainly. The women at the palace laundry love to gossip about other women. They have the same opinion as any with common sense. A sorcerer's place is in the tower, brewing potions and devising horoscopes from stars rather than meddling in politics. Furthermore, she's shameless to display her ass in such provocative attire. Well, if Ada didn't already hold title as Queen of the Whores, Marigold would have it in a trice. Interesting. Thanks. Mm. What does your wife say about the other courtiers? <laughs> it would take weeks to repeat all she said. Foltest, Velerad, Duet, 
Jacques de Oldersburg, Medigold, who were you interested in? Tell me about Foltest. Well, need I tell you all I know? He slept with his own sister and begat Ada. Ill tidings indeed. A curse turned the girl into a striga. A witcher dispelled the curse from the princess, and Foltest was so overjoyed, he spoiled the girl rotten. The little striga became a childish whore. Interesting. Thanks. Mm. What does your wife say about the other courtiers? <laughs> it would take weeks to repeat all she said. Foltest, Velarad, Duet, Jacques de Oldersburg, Medigold, who were you interested in? What's the word on Velarad? Our burgomaster drinks too much and can no longer manage the city's affairs. No wonder, since to curry favor in the court, it is to be a marionette and jump when the king pipes a tune. <laughs> Look around. Bandits, monsters, and city hall is silent. Velarad should step down. Interesting. Thanks. Mm. What does your wife say about the other courtiers? <laughs> it would take weeks to repeat all she said. Foltest, Velarad, Duet, Jacques de Oldersburg, Medigold, who were you interested in? What have you heard about Roderick Duet? Ah, the Nilfgaardian. He sticks to Ada like a burr on a dog's tail, but that threshold's high even for a count. Moreover, he's a knight of the order. So as someone sworn to celibacy, he can only plow the princess in secret. Duet represents the order in court, but I'd say he represents the empire of Nilfgaard and the imperial ambitions of the Black Ones. Interesting. Thanks. Mm. What does your wife say about the other courtiers? <laughs> it would take weeks to repeat all she said. Foltest, Velarad, Duet, Jacques de Oldersburg, Medigold, who were you interested in? What about Jacques de Aldersburg? Grand Master sounds grandiose, doesn't it? Rarely does anyone recall that the Order of the Flaming Rose was once the Order of the White Rose. Now the once proud knights are racists and intriguers, acting under the guise of the highest ideals. Tis the Grand Master's doing. Before his knighthood, Jacques was a vagrant blinded by hatred of elves. One doesn't change so easily. Interesting. Thanks. Hmm? Don't you fear bad-mouthing authorities during martial law? At worst, they'll throw me in the dungeon. I believe we must speak true even of the ruling class. This is our right. Bold words. Indeed. I have no intention to fear a dictatorship based on the exploitation of common men. I will not cower under the grim repression of oligarchs and aristocrats who have enthroned a wrongdoer, a man whose hands are stained with blood. I wish you luck. Mm. What does your wife say about the other courtiers? <laughs> it would take weeks to repeat all she said. Foltest, Velarad, Duet. Jacques de Oldersburg, Medigold, who were you interested in? I'm not sure I'm interested in gossip. Mm. Don't you fear bad-mouthing authorities during martial law? At worst, they'll throw me in the dungeon. I believe we must speak true even of the ruling class. This is our right. Bold words. Indeed. I have no intention to fear a dictatorship based on the exploitation of common men. I will not cower under the grim repression of oligarchs and aristocrats who have enthroned a wrongdoer, a man whose hands are stained with blood. You exaggerate. Foltest's rule can't be that unpleasant. Ah, plague upon Foltest! I spit on monarchy, which long has been corrupt. Strange views. The people should rule. Common people like you and me. You're right. I figured you were a reasonable man, even if a mutant and a pawn. Enough of that already. Mm. We're watching you.
Madness! Have the king keeps sending content. I heard of racial riots in the ghetto. Royal Edict orders a state of emergency. The state of emergency means we're watching toys. A monster Stadium. annihilated a farmer system as a apprentice of the merchant's game. Rushed us out without thought of our pay. Damn, it's hot in this thing. Royal Edict orders a state of emergency. A monster yeah. annihilated a pharmacist and his apprentice at the merchant's We game. want no trouble. Knights should fight monsters. Witches are cruel. You intimidate me truly. Does Roderick Duet truly hail from Nilfgaard? I've been here three times. So many hours waiting. So many hours waiting. I hope I have enough for the bribe. So many hours waiting. Hope I have enough for the bribe. I hope I have enough for the bribe. Chimney tax. Poll tax. Next, please. War tax. What else? Don't get promoted. What a stench. Good girls don't get promoted. Good girls don't oh, get promoted. Back. Yes? Work at Town Hall? Unoriginal. You'll have to try harder. You're a naughty girl. Naughty girls get the cleverest ideas. I'm getting some pretty clever ideas myself. Not so fast. Where's my gift? What's your win? Guess what naughty spoiled girls like best? Let's go where we can be alone. Lead, my lady. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. Fold, glue, stamp. All the These are troubled times. Good girls don't get promoted. Good girls don't get promoted. At least I'm not a seamstress. Oh, my back! Good girls don't get promoted. On three hours, the bureaucracy proves our one of the Knights should fight monsters. Witches are cruel. I'm mad. My friends from the monastic neighborhood. We want no trouble. They told me to watch for those with a the salamander badge. They rushed us out without thought of our pay. Don't interrupt. I spotted the sorceress Marigold. Though a witch. She's beautiful. Perfect. Vivaldi is insolvent. What a catastrophe.
This outfit's uncomfortable. My brother gifted all he owned to the Order to become a knight. I am so proud. A Kigamore jumped out of the tunnel right next to me. My master dislikes me, whereas my little The price of salt is dropping because of the trade war with India. Carry on. Vivaldi is insolvent? What a catastrophe! Why did they declare martial law in this district alone? A bed. That's what I need. If another soldier bothers me, I'll demonstrate what a crested nobleman can do. You're Geralt of Rivia. You slew the dragon from Quartz Mountain. Secret fancies my daughter. You Princess Ada should marry, and Foltest should abdicate in favor of his son-in-law. Is that so? Why hasn't the king armed the guild? Perhaps he wants control of all our men. Have you heard the prices they demand? My grandfather was a valet. My Bell father a butler. I followed in their footsteps. A witcher, hide your women. What are they scheming? Nothing breeds happiness like a good transaction. I inherited land, but decided to live in the city. May these weapons find elven backside. Merely tell his teeth. Talents are talents, but nothing beats experience. How can I help? What is this place? A factory. Were you raised in the woods? Actually, I was raised in the woods. Then behold, the newest factory in Temeria. We manufacture more arms than all sword makers combined. Hmm. Yes? Who owns the factory? The shareholders prefer anonymity. Can I contact them? I'll pass along a message. Can I purchase arms? Sorry, no individual customers. Who are these swords for? Confidentiality requires. Wait, industrial spy, are you? Just curious. 
I would tell you, but for the confidentiality clause. So, a contract. Quiet, or court spies will hear us. The royal court imposed secrecy. Can't the royal court know about the order? Quiet, I beg you. Certain agents I can speak with openly, while others I can't. I get it. There are two factions at court, one of which ordered weapons while the other remains ignorant. I've said too much. Don't repeat this anywhere. Just one more thing. I'm busy. Don't dare say a word. The catalyst worked. An explosion nearly threatened, but once again the Zeracanian masters are shoveling manure. I had an itch in my nose there. Take care. No jesting with the catalysts of pyrite. But I didn't sneeze. Still here? When we first spoke, you mentioned Zeracanian masters. I attempted to solve the riddle of steel using a worthless Zeracanian book. I'd gladly swap it for something else. Like what? Red meteorite iron ore for my experiments. Which book? Zeracanian. Something about explosive substances. May be useful. Still here? What do you do? I'm developing a Philosopher's Stone. I'll share with you the gold obtained from the transmutation of lead and throw in free the guarantee of eternal youth. Seriously? I'm from the University of Oxenfurt. They hired me to improve the composition of the steel in arms production. Too brittle? Too expensive. It's nearly iron and very contaminated. Do you have alchemical ingredients for sale? I'm a scholar, not an alchemist. I despise superstition. Isn't alchemy a science? Rubbish! Magic and alchemy will disappear from the world. Science alone will remain. My friend Kalkstein considers himself an alchemist. Kalkstein? <laughs> we laugh at his pseudo-scientific mumbling. Did you peruse his metamorphoses? Hogwash, written in cloudy language meant to disguise the author's incompetence. Metamorphoses? Not bad. Can you imagine such insanity as the concept of substance codependence? Kalkstein writes about coexistence, not codependence. Entirely different. The last sentence states that in the case of substances, the terms codependence and coexistence are interchangeable. Seriously? I'll review it. That formula... Still here? Bye. Next time, don't arrive when I'm mixing explosive substances. I'll try not to. I'm busy. We want no trouble. The state of emergency means we're watching. Yes. Godspeed. <laughs> Plenty of customers today. You wouldn't wonder at my being here if you knew my wife. Why the higher class? This should be banned. This should be banned. Till tomorrow, plebs. Plenty of customers today. Everything's better before the new guard war. Greetings, sir. Greetings, blue-eyed one. What would you have, my white-haired lord? I wanted to start out talking. All right, let's speak. 
Giacomo Cassano claims nothing surpasses cultured conversation as foreplay. What do you dream of, blue eyes? <sighs> I would like the night to last forever. Not knights on white steeds and other nonsense. I'm no ordinary girl. I can prove it. Simply ask. I think your brother may be looking for you. What? No! I have no family. You sure? Entirely. This is my home. My sisters of the night. I must be mistaken. Yes. Never mind. Take care. We're closed. The Lady of the Night won't see just anyone. I have something for your mistress. You have something, you say? So go to a brothel and put it to good use. Shove off! I thought this was a brothel. This is the Night House, the best brothel in Temeria. It's not for vagabonds in leather rags. I have gold. You won't bribe me. I'm doomed. Come in. I'm doomed. Come in. Talk to the Lady of the Night. My, that's a large sword. Talk to the Lady of the Night. I want too much. Well, is that polite? Barging in without an invitation? I'm here on business. Then refusing to answer questions. The Geralt of Rivia I heard of was a courteous witcher. Forgive me, madam. I lost my memory. I know, witcher. I followed your deeds for some time. Why the interest? My lover, whom I've never forgotten, called you friend. He perished helping you battle a powerful foe. But that was long ago. What brings you here? What do I need to do to spend the night with these beauties? Forget you're a witcher and call yourself a friend. Forgive me, madam, but I don't understand. Be patient. In time you will. Who are you? I'm the Queen of the Night. I realize my clients' dreams, leaving them relaxed and content. With empty coin sacks. I fulfill their dreams. If only for a brief moment. And dreams are priceless. You mentioned times past. Could you tell me about your man? I never said he was a man. More importantly, you were a friend to him. Alas, Regis just drank too much. Thus we parted. His habit nearly killed him. Angry peasants attacked him. After he recovered, he led a loner's life. Until he met you. Sadly, I remember nothing. Don't concern yourself with that. I appreciate that at his death he had friends. True friends. Take care. Ruffians attacked me last night. They mentioned some business. What non? I'll call the guards. They've rushed us out without thought of our Royal plan. edict orders a state of emergency for the neighborhood. We have no time to talk. Children away. Turn them into witches. 
Greetings. My specialities involve more than common blacksmithery. You're a swordsmith? Someone who understands. Can I help? I'd like my sword enhanced. Before I evaluate the sword, you must fetch me a gemstone. A gemstone? Why not gold? I dislike taxes and guild payments. Thus, I prefer goods in exchange for my services. What do you want? A precious stone suitable for the hilt of a weapon for Count de Wet. I'll be back. We want no trouble. Behold, Do I look like the a best. Monster? Welcome, noble beverages and other goods. Edict orders a state of emergency. A monster okay. annihilated a farmer system as a practice of the merchant's game. What? A real art. No reason to be here, white haired one. I detest you. I like the type of the marketplace. <laughs> Would you care to support the arts? Financially? Indeed. Good art supports itself. See you. Don't disturb. Burgermaster Velarad has a hold.
Oh, not now, Geralt, please. Heaven's God. He takes us. I'd like to know him better. My taxes support twits in city. It's not every day I get an illustrious customer like you. Greetings. Can I help you? It's not every day I get an illustrious customer like you. Greetings. Can I help you? I need rest. Got a room? Yes, five orins.
Yes? There's a blue-eyed courtesan at the whorehouse. My sister would never degrade herself so. I have no proof, but this woman matches your description. Obtain proof. My family's honor is at stake. I'll do what I can. Do not anger me further. We shall speak tomorrow. Why do you stare? Care to see my wares? Like the old day. Finally, someone will appreciate my wares. Always shocked with your sword. Yes? You produce weapons? We produce swords and hatchets of the best quality. Armor also. Business goes well. We can't keep up with orders. Who's ordering weapons these days? Recently, we filled a lucrative order to our monastic shielders. Knights purchase at their own cost. Their weapons and armor aspire to art. But how can a few knights compare with hundreds of orderly shielders? Our calling is mass, fast, and solid. A thousand Farkin spearheads for a thousand Farkin shielders. Therein lies the future of our industry. Relax. I get it. Sorry. Ten thousand crossbow bolts! Dog's balls! Let's not forget the arbalester.
I hope you meet your quota. Yes? I'd like to spend the evening with you. With pleasure, white-haired one. But you must first make a contribution to the House of the Night. A mere 500 orins. Thank you. Follow me. I wanted to experience this fantasy of mine. Patience. First a hot bath. Then your dreams will come true. Yes? What an interesting scar on your neck. Like it? It adds character. Intriguing. If you like, I'll show you more. Never mind. Take care. Care to see my wares? Yes? There's a blue-eyed courtesan at the whorehouse. My sister would never degrade herself so. I have proof. I saw fang marks on her neck just as you described. How did this happen? She must be under some spell, that of the vampire who bit her. Perhaps she too has been transformed. Maybe. Witcher, you must help. The vampire clearly haunts the brothel. I'll do what I can. Yes? Farewell. It is our moral duty to defend this city. Care to see my wares?
like a lash. Okay guys, uh, this is the end of the video in the part 31 and in the next part we will finishing the blue eyes and after that we will end, uh, go back to the temporal quarter and after that maybe we will go back to this one so have fun everyone and keep watching and don't forget to press like and subscribe, bye!